Welcome back to Today in AZ. NASA is looking to make history next month. It's scheduled to land a probe with some Arizona connections on an asteroid. Team 12's Matt Uris has the details on the challenges ahead. And I knew right away we were in for a challenge. So let's say you had a 15 passenger van and you had to park it in the only place without rocks while the parking lot was moving 63,000 miles per hour. That's NASA's task, landing a probe called OSIRIS-REx on a small asteroid called Bennu. The voice you're hearing is one of the team members leading the mission. First of all, there is nothing that looks like a beach anywhere on this asteroid. Instead, it is covered by boulders. This is a rough, rugged, rocky surface. The landing spot has been dubbed Nightingale, and NASA spent all of 2019 finding the right spot for the problem nicknamed O-Rex. Mapping this asteroid in exquisite detail with cameras, with our laser altimeters, and with our amazing spectrometers. The NASA project is being led by scientists at the University of Arizona. OSIRIS-REx is supposed to land, grab some of the asteroid's organic material, blast off again, and return to Earth. It's supposed to help scientists better understand how life got started on our planet. Based on preliminary research, Bennu promises to be a researcher's dream. So Bennu really delivered for us here. And I can't tell you how excited I am to get those samples back into our laboratories and begin that sample analysis phase of the mission. OREX will spend about five seconds on the comet and will return to Earth with its sample in September 2023. Matt Uris, 12 News.